So, so let's talk about the, the, the Mars Society. Like what, tell anyone that may not be familiar with it at all. Um, let, let, let's, let's give a breakdown for them. Yeah, absolutely. So we are the world's largest nonprofit organization that's specifically focused on sending humans to Mars. Mm. We want to settle Mars. We've been at it now for 23 years wow. um, this August. And so, um, you know, the, the amount of progress we've made in those 23 years to me is just amazing. I mean, now you have, now we could really taste Mars. It's, yeah. it's close. <laughs> I mean, it's going to happen. Like it's not this 50 to a hundred year science fiction thing. Yeah. Now we're almost there. And, and you and I and others listening, we're going to see it happen in our lifetime. Yeah. It's going to happen very soon. Um, and so we're, we've been all about that. We have chapters around the world. We're, we're, made, we're made up of everyday people um, that, are, that are interested in Mars and that are trying to see what they can do to contribute to that mission of settling Mars, of, of opening up. Mars is a second home for humanity. Mm. You know, and we go there. We don't go there to leave Earth. We go there to help understand Earth and help make life on Earth better for everyone by developing technology and science and increasing our awareness of the universe. Yeah. And so it's not this, you know, a lot of people say, why don't you spend so much money is spent on space? We got to spend that money back here on earth, deal with all the social issues, deal with yeah. all the pollution and the climate change. Well, I would argue that we can do both. We can mm -hmm. actually explore space and develop new discoveries and develop new technologies yeah. that have dual uses back on earth to solve a lot of those problems. I mean, space, there's an abundance of resources in space. Mm. And there's so many things that humanity is going to be able to do once we learn the, the skill of traveling to other planets, of setting up colonies and settlements and um, orbiting space stations around the moon and Mars and earth um, and, and the outer planets. There's so many things we're gonna be able to do to help mm what the situation is here on earth so yeah the, so that's so we're we're laser focused on mars we have people that work at nasa that work in isa there's so many things happening right now um with the mars yeah. society it's, it's <laughs> kind of overwhelming sometimes but uh I, you're, you're so busy yeah i i've been following you on linkedin and, and seeing all the different stuff you've been doing and like it's it's wild 